Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So we've just had a look at the StatCounter Global Stats survey results for the desktop browser market share worldwide for March 2024, and that video will be in the end screen. And now it's time, if you are interested, to have a look at the desktop Windows version market share worldwide for the month of March. Now, Windows 10 and Windows 8 are the only versions to have increased in market share. All the others have decreased. So starting at the back, Windows 8 has increased from 0.22% to 0.29%. Windows XP, as mentioned, has decreased from 0.52% to 0.39%. And although it's decreased, it's still used more than Windows 8. Windows 8.1 has decreased from 0.66% to 0.44%. And I'm sure, as I've mentioned previously, that in the next month or two, Windows XP will overtake Windows 8.1 to be the fourth most used Windows version, according to StatCounter. Windows 7 has decreased from 3.1% to 3.04%. And then Windows 11 has have dropped quite significantly from 28.18% from February to 26.72% for March. So not able to hit that 30% mark just yet. And then Windows 10 has increased from 67.23% to 69.04% and is still the more dominant Windows version as we can see Compared to Windows 11, there's quite a major gap when it comes to that market share. So obviously Windows 10 still very popular. And because of that, um, as I've mentioned previously, I do seriously doubt that Microsoft will end official support for Windows 10 in October next year, 2025. There's just too much market share as, um, I'm, as far as I'm concerned. Now heading to the chart to give us a bit of a wider overview. Yeah, at the top we can see Windows 10 since... September last year has decreased ever so slightly from month to month, although it has increased between February and March. The opposite has been happening with Windows 11, where from September it's been increasing ever so slightly, although it's decreased this month. Then yeah, at the bottom, um, not much really um, happening when it comes to a significant up and down movement when it comes to market share between Windows 7, 8.1 XP and Windows 8. And those are all found here um, at the bottom. Not much real movement going on there. So that's the StatCounter Global Stats Survey results for the desktop Windows version market share worldwide, comparing those market shares percentages between February and March 2024. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.